Okay, let's walk through how to swap your Doge for other tokens on ThorSwap. So once launched, the main ThorSwap dashboard is going to be nicely themed for Doge. Uh, so you'll very easily just be able to go to swap now. For this demo, I'll be on the stage net, so things will look a little bit different. The numbers will be a little bit off, but once live, everything will be accurate and look like this, and you'll be able to get here at app.thorswap.finance, or from thorswap.finance, you can just launch the app. Okay, so first we're gonna go up to connect, and we're going to connect our key store wallet, which is compatible with Doge. You can leave all the chains selected to connect all, or you could just connect the ones you're going to be using, but might as well leave them all. And you choose the file and find your key store file and decrypt it with your decryption password. And now we can check our wallet and verify that yes, it is connected. And we've got our Doge right here. So now to swap, you can either click on swap, which will take you to the main swap portal where you can select any token, or you could just select it right here, or on launch, it's also going to be featured right here. But for now, I'll just go to the standard swap portal to show you how you can select any token to and from. So for this first swap, let's swap from Doge and let's swap to Litecoin. Okay, so let's just swap 10 Doge to Litecoin and you'll immediately see it will mock up how much Litecoin you'll be receiving. In this particular example, the slippage fee is quite high because on this testing network, the liquidity is very low, but this will not be the case generally. Only if you're swapping very, very large amounts such that you'd be disrupting the balance of the liquidity pools. Here you'll see the other breakdown of fees. There is a small Doge fee. This is for sending the Doge into the network and then a small Litecoin fee, which is for sending the Litecoin back out to you. So the total fee here is 58 cents. And these fees just depend on the tokens that you're swapping and not the total amount. So here 58 cents is a pretty high proportion of this amount of swap, but that will not be the case when you're swapping larger amounts. So we can just hit swap here and type our password, confirm. And while you're waiting for that swap, you can see it pending here. Um, I'll explain one cool little feature, which is that here you'll see the recipient address for the Litecoin, which is of course your Litecoin address that you have connected. You could put a Litecoin address that you don't even have connected here, another wallet that you owned or potentially a friend or anything. Only thing to be careful of here is do not use a centralized exchange address because those are shared addresses and require a memo to make sure it goes to your account. So only put in non-custodial wallet addresses that you control. Okay, so now it's showing that the Litecoin has been received. We can look at our wallet and verify that, yep, there's some Litecoin there. Okay, so now that we have our Litecoin, let's say we wanted to swap from Litecoin to something else on the ThorChain network. We would just select from all the assets here. Not everything is showing because I am on the stage net again, but let's just say that you had any other token, Litecoin or any other, and you wanted to buy more Doge. So let's just go back and put Litecoin to Doge. I'll just put a random amount, just a couple bucks and we'll see the slippage fee and then the Litecoin inbound fee and then the Doge outbound fee. And let's swap that. And again, we can see the swap pending here. We can check on it if we want to. This is the Litecoin transaction and we're just waiting here for that to go through and for, for the Doge to arrive in our wallet. Okay, and there it is, our Doge has arrived. We can always go up to our wallet to verify. And that's all there is to it, to do swaps to and from Doge to other assets via ThorSwap. These are native assets, decentralized swaps with native Doge. That's all it takes to do it.